Hello everyone, my name is Marish Gajdik and on this channel we talk about filmmaking, photography and everything around it. Today I'm gonna be doing a review of this little light from Digital Photo. They asked me if I wanted to check it out and review and I said yes because I like those kind of lights a lot. This one has a magnet, it has RGB but I'll tell you all about it in a minute. But let's start with what we get in the box. And what we get in the box is the light itself, the charging cable, the instruction manual and also we get this uh, clamp for the laptop which I feel like it's an extra, uh, it wasn't in the or original box, it was sort of like in the Amazon box I get it uh, in, so I'm not sure if you're gonna get this one uh, with the light or you need to buy it separately but I got it so I'm gonna talk about it. So this light has a full RGB uh, so this is nice because you can use any of the colors you would like and you can basically put it in a background somewhere or do like a contrasting light that I have here like the orange one here uh, from the other light but yeah, you can basically use this light mostly for those kind of things. It won't be too powerful to light you from the front. Uh, it will be more like a vlogging light. You can see how close it is to my face and then you can see it on a camera. But if it's further away, it won't be doing much. So uh, it's more like a um, vlogging light that you're gonna put on your phone or on your camera, on top of your camera and it's going to give you a little bit of extra light in those low light situations so it won't be like a light that i'm using here to light me fully it will be more like a extra light from the back or from the side you can see or it's going to be more like a vlogging light and then you can see it's it's pretty good you see it also has a white light mode from 2500 Kelvin to 9000 Kelvin so you're going to be able to match it with some other lights you're using and this is so nice as well because sometimes you might need a warm light or sometimes you might need the cool light or daylight so you have it all here so this is really nice about it too. The light also has the CRI of 95 and this is pretty standard in those sort of lights on the market. It has a built-in magnet uh, on the back uh, over here. So this is really nice for when you want to stick it to the fridge, stick it to a car or something like that. And you can basically light yourself this way. And you can also like stick it to some metal frames or to the tripod or things like that. It weighs 90 grams, so it's pretty light and it's pretty small too. It is uh, 85 by 70 by 26 millimeters in size, so you shouldn't be worrying about put it in your pocket or put it in, in your bag. Uh, it's pretty small and compact. It has a three of those uh, hot shoe mounts and on the side, on the top, on the other side and it mounts to your camera or your tripod via here. Uh, it's standard tripod mount, one quarter and the hot shoe mount which is pretty nice. If you want to put it on a tripod, you can put it on a tripod. If you want to put it in a hot shoe mount, you can do it too. On the back, you have the power button, which is for the changing of the modes or powering the light itself. So it's really nice. You have the screen which shows you the battery level, the brightness and the, uh, in, depending from the mode, it shows you the Kelvins, it shows you the color you're using or the uh, effect you're using too. Uh, and also you have the USB-C socket to charge it and that's really nice because everything should be on USB-C in 2021. On the top you have two dials, one is for dimming and one is for color temperature changing or color changing or the mode changing. 
The light also has the built-in battery which will last you for at least 2 hours on a full brightness and also for 15 hours on a lowest brightness and if you want to use it for longer you can obviously charge it while you're using it and if you want to charge it fully it will take you two and a half hours not when you're using it but just when you want to charge it two and a half hours fully charging so this is pretty good it also has the mode with these effects uh, it has 20 of them i'm not going to talk about all of them because there's so many of them i'm not even able to name them all but you have this cop car effect you have the ambulance, you have the fire truck, etc, etc, lightnings and that kind of thing. So uh, whatever you want to find, you have it like lightning, flash, uh, whatever, like this changing color effect. It's pretty nice. It's pretty nice to have that. It might be useful for some people for some situations. The build quality is pretty nice. It's built out of plastic but it's nice quality plastic and you shouldn't be worrying about putting a new pocket and breaking it or putting it in a new backpack and breaking it as well but if you're gonna drop it it might break uh it might not i'm not sure i'm not planning on dropping it but you need to keep in mind that it's made out of plastic not metal uh, so yeah but that's good for the low uh, weight and uh, for compactness and for being able to like use it in the field if it will be from the metal it would be much much heavier for sure I think this is pretty much everything about this light uh, I like it I'm gonna use it in the backgrounds of my videos for sure uh, it's not very bright uh, but it's pretty nice for the background um, light for like accent lights or the backlight uh, light like I'm using here for the orange uh, for from other lights so I'm gonna be using this one for sure for that kind of things uh, so if you want to check it out I'm gonna leave the links in the description uh, that's gonna be affiliate links to Amazon most likely uh, you can check it out there and if you buy it you're gonna support my channel which I'm very thankful for and if we're talking about support you can leave the like subscribe to the channel and ring the bell that helps a lot that motivates me to create more content and if you out there uh, you could check out my Instagram too I post a lot of photos there a lot of videos a lot of stories and I think you might like it if you like my videos here uh, so if you want go check it out and I'm gonna be thankful if you do leave a follow there too. I think this is it for this video so I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye!